Tim Holtz Media Grip is a non-slip surface that is so handy for many different techniques, such as ink blending, stamping, and stenciling. In today's video, we're going to show you some of the many uses that you can utilize this Media Grip for to help keep your items from shifting while you're working. The Media Grip comes in a 12 by 10 and a half inch roll. It's a washable, reusable, and heat resistant surface meaning you're gonna be able to utilize it in many different formats. When you get your media grip, you're going to take it out of the box, unroll it, and you'll notice it has a plastic covering on it. If you're going to cut the media grip down, you're definitely going to want to keep the plastic coating on until you have trimmed it, as that will help prevent it from sticking to your trimmer while you cut. I've cut mine down to some of my most used sizes, and I've stored them in our Simon Says Stamp Positively Everything Storage Sleeves, we recommend just cutting off two of the sides so that way it opens and closes like a book. And this will help keep your media grip clean while you're not using it. Besides using it for card and tag sizes, you can also make little squares that will hold your ink pads in place while you're working. When you have some media grip sheets that are sized for some of your most favorite card or project sizes, you can tack this down onto your glass work surface lay your project on top and you can see right away it does not skid. Then you can take your smaller media grip pieces for your ink pads, pick up some ink and then just start ink blending to your heart's content across the paper. As you can see I don't need to hold the paper in place because the media grip is doing that for me. You can also use it for tools too. Our Simon Says Stamp stamp and stencil mat has a slick surface on the back but if you lay a piece of media grip on top if you're working on a glass surface like I am here, your media grip will keep the stamp and stencil mat from actually shifting across your work surface. So as you're working, you don't have to worry about it sliding. It can also work great for holding stencils in place. Here I have a Tim Holtz stencil and I'm going to apply some paste through it and the media grip is helping keep that stencil from shifting as I apply the paste. Even if you get paste on this mat, it will clean off easily with just some soap and water. If you're stamping inside of a stamp positioning tool, you can lay a piece of media grip inside and then put your paper on top. Your paper won't shift, so you can even put it in the middle of the stamping tool and not have to use a corner. This will help keep your paper in place while you stamp and create beautiful backgrounds and designs. The Tim Holtz Media Grip has so many uses in your craft room. For holding paper in place, keeping your stencils tacked down onto your project, Keeping tools from shifting while you work, you've got a lot of options for being able to incorporate this tool into your everyday crafting. Be sure to check out the links below in the video description to find the Media Grip over at our Simon Says Stamp store. There are also links below to the Simon Says Stamp storage sleeves, so that way you can keep your Media Grip clean when you're not using it. I hope this video was helpful, and please be sure to give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Thanks so much for watching! I'm Heidi, Simon's mama and founder at simonsaysstamp.com. Thank you so much for watching our video. If you like what you just saw, be sure to press the thumbs up and subscribe to see more great content.